Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Selescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, here we are in our Can-Am League and tonight we're going to be at Donnybrook Park. And, uh, well, let's go down and watch the race and afterwards I'll show you how I built this track. I'm going to fix it before I leave to Mexico. Oh, okay, so we got myself set up as a ghost car. I forgot your car was <laughs> Alright. That's one car down on the pace car. Car death. Pace car still holding in. Then ramming guys. <laughs> oh. Oh. Josh, you're off. It's a wild track for such a simple track. Just falling off everywhere. It's not a ghost car, it's my relief driver. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I need a, another foot down the side of the tables. Oops. Okay. Oh, I know. Whoa. Second card down. Where am I going? I don't know. <laughs> uh, three, five, four, six, seven, two. Base car in fifth place. <laughs> Jeff again. Whoops. Three, five, four, two. Oh, it's 40 seconds. Oh. Third card down for the pace car. How many more? More laps. Three, five, four, two. We got 25 seconds. 25 seconds. 
Oh, nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> I hope the camera got that. I hope so. 532. 532. 532, yeah. Oh, oh, yes. oh right. <laughs> I would just be a nice. Oh. Oh. Kevin, Kevin's over at the last. Okay, somebody. Uh, yeah, 532. <laughs> <laughs> Pace car got in fourth. Yay, it still counts to me. <laughs> I got beat by the pace car. <laughs> <laughs> I knocked the pace car off three times. All right. And wasn't that a wonderful race? And here we have our scoreboard. Now we're remodeling the store a little bit, so this is sitting on the floor currently. But as you can see, I got 26 points. Here, let's zoom in. Josh has 20. Roger and Mark were not there. Kevin got 51, Howard got 60 points, Dale got 21, and Jeff got 25. Now if we look at the positions, I'm in third with 150, Josh is in fourth with 126, Roger is fifth with 119, Mark is eighth with 100, Kevin is second with 217, Howard is first with 277, Dale is sixth with 109, Glenn is seventh with 103, and Jeff is ninth place with 79 points. Now let's go see how we built this wonderful, amazing track. And we'll see you next week in Edmonton, Alberta. And here is our wonderful version of this track. As you notice, the tables are in the regular rectangle with a couple of overhangs. One in the middle and one on the end. So let's go down to our start-finish gate and see how this goes. So here we are at our start finish gate and if you want a reference point come over here there is our little table stuck on the end just half and our well we got about 8 to 12 inches here off the edge before that curve comes in so you could use that as a reference and from that point we have one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven straights and then here we got our 3-30 and 2-30s. We got a 90 degree turn. Actually, for reference, just put this right to that edge. And then one, two, three straights. And here we have a 3-30, two of them, and 2-30. And then one, two straights. And there's our map so far. You can see how it's going. I had to take some of this out in the middle because it just didn't fit. Okay, getting back to it, we have one, two 1 1-60s and a 1 30. After this, they're all the tight curves, so we've got a straight and then a 120 degrees, so two 2 60s. Then another straight, a 1 30. Two more straights, another 1 30. Two 1 quarter pieces right here. Then coming the other way, a 1 60. A straight, a 1 60, then one, two, three, four straights, and then a 120 degree curve with two 1 60s. And of course, we've got our uh, 2 30s on the other end, and then we're back to our start finish gate. And that's how you build your own version of this track. Hope it helped.